Hello everyone and welcome to another edition of the NEC in 90. Let's get you caught up on all the things you might have missed this weekend. The Bryant Bulldogs became the fourth program in league history to win four straight NEC men's tennis titles after defeating St. Francis U 4-1 on Sunday. Bryant took a 1-0 lead into singles play and made it 2-0 when redshirt sophomore Matt Kuhar picked up a 6-3, 6-0 victory in number one flight action. Bryant built the lead to 3-0 with Mike Plute's win at the number five slot, and then freshman Guido Argentini clinched it with a 6-4, 6-4 win at the number four spot. The Bulldogs will go on to represent the NEC in the upcoming NCAA championships in mid-May. LRU Brooklyn capped a dominating run through the three-day event as the Blackbirds did not surrender a single point in the tournament. After taking the doubles point against the defending NEC champion Knights to kick off the final, LIU got wins from Sasha Bolwig at number two singles, sophomore Malin Layson at the number four slot, and the championship was clinched when Anna Gregorian took the number one flight 7-5-6-2. And Sacred Heart made history on Sunday at LPJ International, securing the program's first ever Northeast Conference Women's Golf Championship. The Pioneers shot one under par as a team during the final round of the tournament at the Jones Course and finished the three-day event with a new 54-hole record of 888. Pioneer senior Ellen Niver claimed individual medalist honors by winning a thrilling tie-breaking playoff against teammate and 2016 NEC individual champion Chelsea Sedler. That's it for this week's edition of the NEC in 90. For NECfrontrow.com, I'm Kyle Turner, and I'll be back again next week.